This week on Scam School, it's entirely too much Andrew Maine. This episode of Scam School brought to you by the National Campaign Against Drunk Driving. Welcome to the show that might have gotten busted, bringing a flask to a baby shower. Scam School, the only show dedicated to social engineering at the bar and on the street. I'm your host, Brian Brushwood, and this week we are joined again by Andrew Main and Justin Robert Young of the WeirdThings.com podcast, and this time we actually learned some wizardry. Spells. Screw you, a cus- All right, gentlemen, back again. Of course, Andrew Maine and Justin Robert Young, uh, my co-hosts on the Weird Things podcast. Um, what do you got for us this time? And by the way, not gonna stuff napkins in my face. Nice try. Not well played. Uh, I don't know what else to do. <laughs> well, I'm gone. All right. <laughs> All right, Brian, as you know in Weird Things, we talk a lot about weird things. Yeah. Now, one of the problems we talk about weird things is you want evidence, you want proof, like Bigfoot. You want a Bigfoot photo. Yeah, right? I do. We don't get enough of that stuff. You ever do a trick for somebody and they go, no, that's not the way it worked. Like, uh, you know, you switch napkins on. Oh, yeah, yeah, like yeah. That. They make up how they think like it's done. That. This is the settlement. So it's a simple thing, okay? It, it's just, we're going to use, we're going to use an iPhone camera. Okay? All right. Okay. I'm going to have you take a photograph, okay? And what we're going to do is we're going to try to, uh, Sugar, smell, smell. Okay, we're gonna try. Sure. To, what we're gonna try to do is capture one of these. Now you can use anything. We use this. We're gonna try and capture the sugar packet as it vanishes. We're just take a photo, just right now. All right, so you guys want me to take a photo of the of the sugar packet? Yeah, just go take a photo. I'm gonna focus right on it. Got it. Right, so you got that? Um, yes, sir. The lighting here is a little bit unusual, but to say the least. And that is pitch black, okay, and we okay, have okay, cameras okay. in here. So check this out, Brian. We'll take the packet, okay? Now, I'm going to wave my hand over it, okay? Nothing happens. I need you to wave your hand over it, okay? All right. Yeah. Justin, wave your hand over. Help me. Okay. Now, both of you. Yeah, okay. I'm feeling the magic, bro. All right, here we go. Got it, got it, got it, got it. Ah! Did you, did you look like it started to be materialized to you? Almost. I almost felt it. Did you feel it? Did you uh, feel it? it looked... Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I did feel All right, that's enough. <laughs> Try that again. Like, I'm really trying to make it work for Brian, you. you're not very good at this. I you apparently not. You stink as a magician. No, that's true. Actually, it's terrible. You know, it, feels, it feels a little bit lighter, to be honest with you. Which... Oh, sweetness. The, the sugar cool. vanished. Yeah, I know. It's kind of cool, though. Brian, is I want you to pick up the phone. I don't want to touch it. Pick up the phone. Let's check out the before. Let's check out the photo you took before, OK? All right, here we go. That's where it went. Is that the photo of the? Freaking! That is awesome. I'll tell you, no, Brian. It's not like you're gonna find another photo in there. That's that's it. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. You took the photo. Wait a minute. <laughs> no, now it's good. <laughs> this was a stupid He's not gonna lie. This stank on ice before. <laughs> you were all very disappointed until no, this point. No, that's phenomenal. All right, screw you. I want to know how this was done, but we got to thank our sponsors. Yes. Here we go. I uh, thank you, sponsor here. <laughs> Dude, Labor Day weekend is right around the corner. We're talking insane parties, tons of drinking. Hell, I'm going to be at Dragon Con in Atlanta, Georgia. It's like the geek's burning man out there. Go out there, have a good time, drink if you're old enough to do so, but do me a favor, promise you won't be one of these dumbasses who drinks and then gets behind the wheel. The police are going to be out in force from August 19th through September 5th. We're talking a nationwide campaign to crack down on impaired driving. Do yourself a favor, drive sober, or get pulled over. Every year, nearly 12,000 people die on our roads because of impaired driving. That would be the equivalent to about 30 jumbo jets crashing every single year. And if you're not worried about dying, then just think about this. You're going to get caught. We got record numbers of state and local law enforcement and highway safety officials across the nation taking part in the biggest search for drunk drivers day and night, making the roads safer for the rest of us. Do us a favor, man. Drive sober or get pulled over. Here's the deal. So everybody carries phones around with them. There's a way you can do this with somebody else's phone, which we can talk about. But the idea is, as soon as they see like the sugar pack and like, oh, it's all right, and you can do 
really, if you want to do a little more silent hand, you can do a really great vanish of the sugar from it. But this is a very simple method we'll get into. Well, but I'll tell you, here's what's interesting is when you picked up the sugar packet, I took it for granted because it was puffy that there was, that there was of course, sugar in there. Yes. And what's funny is as you had us do all this silly waving our hands over there, at some point I was like, that looks really thin. Like it started to occur to me that something was off with the packet. And I almost wonder if from a sleight of hand thing, you couldn't just kind of wave your finger you can. across and flatten you, 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 it. Or... You absolutely can. There's ways to go in there and to do that where you can you can make it look like, oh, look, you know, you've got you've got the, the sugar in there and you can go like, but it starts to go away. Vanish away, okay? right. So a little I, advanced technique, absolutely. Right. So I'm assuming I'm right in the first part in that you just removed all the sugar from one of the packets beforehand, right? That is correct, sir. Okay, and obviously, uh, to inflate it, you just blow in it, because that's yes. clearly what you just did. Yeah. No, so, it's not what I did, right? It's yeah, not right. what I did. So, so you make a cut it's the back here. magic move. gust. So you start off, to start off, you need an empty sugar packet. So you make one that looks, you pull it up like a pillow. Right. So you, you pull out a few of these, you lay them on the table. You don't want to pull them out of your pocket, just have them there, okay? Yeah. And be like, oh, sugar. And you or maybe them, even stick it into yeah, the little tray thing the little that tray they here, have. And right. they hear the sugar, and that's the thing, it's hard to hear here, but you'll hear the sugar. No, you know what you could do? I guess you could even, you could pick up the empty one and a real one. Yeah, and shake and, them both. And, and yeah, shake it. Yeah, 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 when, when he held them all up to you, he shook. Yeah, all, you shake them. All so four of them together. Oh, that's great. So there's no way that you can. So that's how we started. Yeah. Is like when it starts off, we, we were so you shake them, you hear them. I put them there, and then I just take the the empty one that I want. And so we take the empty one, okay? Yep. If you have a few grains inside of there, sometimes you hear. But don't worry, you take the empty one, you put that there. Right. Now we bring out the phone, okay? Now you set up your phone in advance, and you set it up in a way to make it easy to do this trick. Right. So. Obviously, we know how the sugar went away, but how do we get the photo of just the sugar? Right. How do we get just the well, photo well, of that? I guess it's twofold. Not only do you need just the photo of the sugar, but you need it to be the most recently taken yes. photo. Yes. And you need to not have the photo yes. of the sugar packet. That's right. the part that fried me. So what I did is, beforehand, I went and I took a photo of just sugar in my hand. Okay. Right. In pretty much the same position that somebody's going to be looking at with sugar in my hand. I took a photo of that, and then I took a bunch of other photographs and put them in front of there. So if you went through my camera roll, like you did, which I was hoping you would do, yeah, I you did. would see nothing. And if I wanted to be rude, I'd maybe have like Justin flipping you off, you know, flip back to <laughs> yes. like, nothing here, Bri, okay? <laughs> Just Photoshop your face on some pornographic images. You're like, oh, you probably shouldn't have no seen those. No need to Photoshop. Um, <laughs> okay, so, all right. <laughs> What we do is I take the photo of just the sugar, okay? And then what I'm going to do is I put a bunch of photographs in front of there. Now, when I want to go do this trick, what I do is I go back to that photo, and on the iPhone, you press here and there, and it allows you to take a screen capture of whatever's on there. That, that is the menu and the lock screen are button at the same time, and it's screen grab. So, like, right, I've so, got, so basically, I've got... that, and, and by taking a screen grab, what you do is you take a photo that was historically like 30 or 40 right. photos back, and all of a sudden it puts it as the most recent photo. Yeah, it makes a copy that's now the most recent photo, okay? Then what I do is I take one more photograph because if you remember, when you look at the camera, okay, on an iPhone, it'll show you the last photo somebody took. So I don't want somebody looking there, looking down there and seeing a photograph of my hand looking, you know, holding what looks like cocaine at this point. Right, okay? of course. Yeah. Okay, so I take a photo of a shot glass or something, so if they look down there, they're just going to see a shot glass, okay? So you took the photo. Remember, you took the photo, and I said, right. oh, let's set this down. This is what I did, is I went to... I took the photo of the, the sugar packet, right. I clicked delete while I'm talking to you, and then I had a photo of a shot glass. Right. I deleted that, so the last photo is now going to be the photo of the sugar. Gotcha. Okay? So that's the conversational talk, oh, let's see if this works, that's perfect. I click delete, wait for delete, click delete, make a delete, set it down, forget about it, go back to the silly nonsense with the sugar packet, waving the hands over all that, and then look, it's gone. Right. Okay, trick. Come back to it, say, yeah, but sometimes we get evidence of this happening. Right. And where did it go? And we look at the iPhone, and there you go. All right, so to recap, first of all, prep one of the sugar packets. Right. You just cut a hole in the back, let all the sugar out, and you blow it up actually like a yeah. balloon, right? Then you pick it up, you shake all the packets, including the empty one, so you hear the shaking sugar sound, which is total convincer. You set up the whole thing about taking a photo before and after. You have them take a photo, and then, uh, and then you, uh, I guess, in that brief moment you pick up the phone, that's when you do... I just take it from you. I go to album, delete that photo as I talk to you. Right. And then you also delete the one before it. Yeah. So that the one with the sugar... Is the last one. Instead of being third or, or second or third from last, becomes the latest photo. Exactly. And then, it, of course, it's even time stamped because if just before the trick, you actually do the screen capture to bring it up to the exactly. front. Brilliant. Brilliant.
And the cool thing is, is that at that point, once you've deleted that second photo, right. you ain't got nothing to worry about. Yeah. You're done. I mean, the yeah, magic- Yeah, they can go of, through all the photos. Yeah, right. I mean, the sticky no finger magic stuff, it's right. over. You know, all you have to do is focus on being a jerk about the like, oh, it's gone And now. if you want to elevate, there are two ways you can elevate this. Okay. Imagine you took that photo and I'm like, hey, let me email this to you or MMS this to you so you can remember this. Okay. And then what I do there is I just send you that photo, okay? So I send you that photo. Yeah, the one where it's it's just the sugar, oh, sugar. in my hand. Right. Okay? So then what happens is we get this, we get the sugar, you get this, and then I can go, before I go there, I go look at your camera, and you go look and you see the sugar there, and you're like, wow, that's pretty cool. Let me see the phone. Right. And All then right? they go through and there's no freaking evidence there. There's no freaking evidence it's, there. That's the beauty of this thing, is the fact that when you're at the ending, it's totally, totally clean, and they can go through and look for everything. Exactly. And they'll exactly. never find it. It's all legit. Yep. Exactly. Awesome. Now, do you want a little a plus way of thing to do without sugar to no, really freak people out? No, I don't. I don't. Absolutely. That's just too I much do awesome. Though, Andrew. I don't have to okay, tell you fine. This, okay. Because Justin wants it. Imagine if you had an accomplice. If you had an accomplice. Somebody on your Let's side. Let's say theoretically a confederate, if you will. Let's say you went to the bathroom. Yep. Okay. Crap. Say you went to the bathroom and we took a photo of just us in an empty chair. Okay. Okay. We put the little blank photo in front of there, the little you know random photo in front of there. You come back like Brian. Let's take a photo to remember this moment. Shut up. We take a photo. Kaching. Delete that. Delete that. Leave it on there. Talk about this and say Brian, you're looking kind of clear right now. Totally. I'm totally checking to see if you actually did that when I went to the bathroom and we took a photo earlier. Thank goodness you did not. <laughs> I was convinced you did that. No, those are really good applications. Good ideas. I like the whole the whole ability to take an old photo and jump it up oh, to yeah, last yeah. in the queue just by using the screen grab it's, function. It's a little I think that's a lot of people don't know you can do that, which yeah. is element of magic. Is have a little principle you can exploit. Absolutely, dude. Brilliant stuff. Thank you hey, so, my very much, gentlemen. Thank you. Yeah. Yes. Get the hell out of my bar. <laughs> All right, sir. First and foremost, we got to give a huge thanks to Andrew Main for slumming with us and giving us this little gem. If you want to see more of his magic, head on over to andrewmain.com. He has 18 bazillion DVDs and books that will blow your freaking mind. Second of all, as you practice one, remember that the magic moment is when the photo transforms from a sugar packet into just the sugar, so you've got to tell a proper story to set that thing up just right. Now, I want to hear about your success stories and failure stories, so post them at the boards at scanschool.tv where you can see all of our episodes right back to episode one. If you're doing the Twitter thing, follow the show at twitter.com slash scamschool. Follow me at twitter.com slash schwood. And while you're at it, why don't you throw me a like at facebook.com slash schwood. Now, don't forget to join us next week because we're going to learn a foolproof method that you can actually cheat at the all-important game of Duck, Duck, Goose. But first, I've got to go find a preschool that'll let me play Duck, Duck, Goose. That didn't sound right. All of a sudden, this whole ending seems like a bad idea. I'm going to the bar. Suck the goat blood. <laughs> as magi, right? Yes. As we are prone to call ourselves when we're, you know, alone. <laughs> yeah, right. we. Say hey, that. magi! Oh, right. 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 magi! As please. you remember, as we were taught in Hogwarts. Here's the problem, okay? Go on. Do a magic trick for somebody, okay? Yes. Right. Well, wow, wow, yes. Can you this out? Yes. Okay. No, that's, I'm not comfortable with this. This is already going bad. No longer. This week on Game School. <laughs> 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 I get are you hot in here, Brian? Are you hot in here? Come on. All right. What's the Trick. Okay, so here's the trick. Here's the trick. I was gonna tell you, the one thing you don't realize you scam school is the amount of times Brian's knee uncomfortably touches you under the table. As you're like, well, bro oh, okay, Brian. <laughs> He's getting you back, roll his right, shoulder, right? I know. Well, Thank you, Brian. Roll it started, roll it started, roll it started roll didn't back. you, Brian?